and don't start with and and we're sort of off um the saturday wrap saturday the 27th of august 2022 bank holiday weekend weather's looking warm 22 to 24 dependent on where you are he says um yeah yet again the saturday wrap isn't being done on a saturday it's being done on a friday lunchtime i do have a good reason for that however before we start future skies north brewing co and full circle brew co or from the toon um newcastle a minus i don't give that out very often it is a pale ale fruity citrus tropical um, very lemony dry refreshing from tesco's i'd recommend it i really would recommend it anyway the reason this is on a friday and not a saturday well it could be on a saturday however i had the day off um some post mot work on the car i mean it was just on the mot certificate it passed the mot and it could have lasted but uh, some of it was corrosion to rear springs some of it was i suspect damage from speed bumps and what with the energy cap prices going up today i thought i'll do it now while i still have the money not that it wasn't that cheap however they said they would take four hours it took two and a half hours and that is a good sign so i've even mowed the lawn right so this will um well i'll go up on wordpress just after midnight this will go up well, almost immediately when i finished it if i haven't cocked it up you know all that sort of stuff i'm just looking for over modulation i think i think i'm okay who knows there you go um if anything a little bit quiet so um the look back on the previous week and um, i'm looking down i don't think i did that much it seemed like i did a lot but not really so let's start out with the standards then the word or the phrase of the week false autumn apparently trees are losing their leaves um, and other plants and animals are thinking it's already autumn in america the fall um due to the lack of water and such like i have to be honest um I had some potatoes out of the garden that were main crop and they looked like they were finished. Actually, they'd all died back. I suspect that was due to lack of watering as well. Um, oh yeah, mm, coming on to another thing. This week, send our water to London in droughts. Also on the same day, which was yesterday, Polar Wales now in drought situation. Please save water um the last reservoir we built in wales was 1972. we have a lot more people in we have a lot more industries in we have a lot more usage so obviously we've done absolutely nothing about putting extra resource in as with roads as with schools as with everything else not that we're alone um but you know when your population goes up your resources have to go up hmm anyway i am trying to save water it did rain this morning actually uh, but there you go so um that was the thing of the week the um let's give our water away while we haven't got any water and yeah you probably have to dig a, a big hole to put big pipes in which would probably cause uh, environmental activists to get a bit upset uh, no easy answers at all for anything so there you go um app of the week pixabay um free stock photography free stock videos free stock music well royalty free anyway um i'll come back to that because yeah it's also a website um i've got on ios um okay right yeah more beer the coach pub at uh, inbridge end oh it's even more lemony now i like that a lot so 
I yeah, start with last Saturday. Uh, you know the buses have been cancelled. Well, I won't. I'm going to take a chance on catching the A bus to Caffili. So I um, went down to the square and caught the Newport bus and then found out the A bus was running this week. And then there was a cloudburst and it hammered down and all that sort of thing. And um, which is interesting because it's rained today. It rained on Wednesday. We are having rain. We're definitely having rain. <laughs> Whatever. You hear the fan. The fan has just come on. Um, probably because of the recording and the heat and the such like. Um, caught the 120 down onto the Tree Forest Industrial Estate, got off at the QED Centre or the XQED Centre, walked behind it, found out the bridge across the Taff was being renovated, closed for a number of months. Back out the way I came, down the end of the estate, across the bridge there, and Bradley took lol. Really, really good. Sat in the corner, listened to podcasts, drank a lot of beer. Did a video, um, four different shots in the same frame, all going together. Um, I'd seen it online, and I thought I'd try it out. And it worked a treat. I really liked it. The only thing is, no sound behind it. Which takes me back to Pixabay. So I've gone online. Uh, I've looked out for some music to go behind it. And... If you search for YouTube music, you can actually download music, which is royalty free. Give them a shout out in your notes, which I will. And um, it's been registered with content ID on YouTube's site. And if that fails, they've actually given you a license to use and the instructions on how to upload your license so they don't pull it down. Because, you know, big business and such like. But music tomorrow i'm going away on a bino mb09 and um, nine binos in eight months which is not bad for me um and i'm going to do the same thing again i'm going to put that behind it as it's a bit of a bed and a starter oh well, that's my plan anyway so that was saturday low fest 11 I'm looking for low fest 12 now but um i have a feeling that as we go into autumn and then winter and the energy price cap has gone up and there is no price cap for businesses a lot of businesses will basically go bust or we'll just go out of business yeah right someday um did i say about desert island discs um there's like desert island discs um but some of them were called discs. um i've done my music um i've got a playlist and I was having a look at how to record it. So I'm um, using loopback. I can have more than one thing fin feed into one input. So I can have Desert Island this. Oh, I'm sorry. I can have Spotify and the microphone going into one input. And I was thinking of using Audio Hijack, which would work. However, in the end, cleanfeed.net. Online recording, online podcasts, remote recording, and it's free for personal use as long as you don't abuse it. Um, that's arranged. That'll happen in the next couple of weeks. And I'm looking forward to it, if for no other reason than tech. Mind you, one of the tracks I picked is 10 minutes long. See if you can guess what it is. Um, it's from my youth. Um, and it's Mark II version of a band. Yeah. Okay, um, Monday, Monday oldie. Okay, Scotch eggs are back, so I didn't have to go to Tesco's. Vinegar isn't back though, so I'm not sure what's going on there. <laughs> okay, whatever. However, I prefer all these Scotch eggs to Tesco's. It was the other way around, but there isn't so much meat on, uh, or sausage meat on uh, all these Scotch eggs, and they're easier to eat. I just prefer it that way. It's more of an eggy taste. <laughs> Tuesday, had to play around with a cleanfeed.net. That seemed to work well. Um, and Wednesday, Pixabay. Downloaded some music, downloaded the license, got it all ready. Get it started tomorrow. And by the way, MB09 is in Monmouth. And there are full English breakfast booked, all you can eat. 
there will be, of course, lots of bacon. Um, it's Ostia. It's only 34 miles away, so saving on the petrol. And I marked the prices for ages and ages before I booked because it was expensive. Um, but it wasn't too bad considering it's a bank holiday weekend. Thursday, officially, the whole of Wales throughout. Ah, Friday, today, postal strike. There's talk that the civil service might have a strike from the end of September. That'll be interesting. Practically everyone's thinking about a strike at the moment. And what with the energy cup? I see things getting interesting. Um, car down to Wessex. Um, as I mentioned, post MOT stuff. Uh, what else? Oh, post COVID times. I'm going to start to think about what has changed since COVID? Okay, so I dropped my car off at 8 o'clock and wandered over to the Cardiff City Stadium. And by the way, there's a cost of coffee, which opens at 8 o'clock in the morning. Online, it opens at 8 o'clock in the morning. Got there. It's now 9 o'clock. I would say half the world is now starting much later in the day. You know, um, let me think. The cost of coffee in Caerphilly used to open at 7, now 8. The cost of coffee in Hereford, that used to open at 6.30 in the morning. Now I think it's either 8 or 9. I like an early start. You know I like an early start. And that, that's one of the changes. The things are just... Hmm. Anyway. And lastly, mow the lawn. I still need to scarify it because there are some sunny even with all the rain scorch parts to it i think that's it really yeah bye bye and uh, i'll see you next week